Are you ready for this sickness? Let's get into it! <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to Economics and Commerce. This is your True Keys video for new comic book day, January 29th. Um, you got a week here in advance. This video, if you're new to this channel, uh, basically pulls out the best books that I think you should try to find in your comic book store next week or order, pre-order in advance that have some sort of key or maybe based on a homage cover or a hot cover or something like that. So these are my picks. Um, for next week so if you're new hit that sub button welcome back to everyone else thanks for coming hit that like button leave me a comment um let's go over it you tell me in the comments which ones you like from this week um that would be great and um let's get into it oh by the way at the end of the video i'm attaching the exchange collectibles video as well as the um video that i'm doing that uh that i did on monday it was a live video about the all like true spec keys that are coming out all next month. I've went ahead and did that for you guys um, so you can kind of look around and get early look at stuff. Let's get into this uh, video though. Thanks so much guys and here we go. All right. First up, probably my favorite cover of the week is from Dynamite Comics. It's Betty Page Unbound. There's multiple different variants of this cover like colored variant, black and white, um, virgin, stuff like that. But it's uh, Betty Page on bound number 10, and it's the Sin City homage cover. I really, really like it. Sick. Next up, another homage cover, which is basically the first appearance of Swamp Thing uh, cover. Uh, art from Aardvark Vandeheim. It's going to be low print. It's called House of Cerebus One Shot. Um, it's a homage cover, and I was reading the previews. It sounds really funny, actually, so I'm trying to try to pick that up if I can find it. Another low print comic coming out. This is more of a key factor. Uh, from AC Comics is Super Babes, starting Femme Force number three. Uh, origin of the Hideous Villainous Gorgana. So it's an origin, origin story key, okay? Next up, pretty big book. Lady Zorro number one from American Mythology. Um, basically, it's a new f appearance of, a, or it's a new female Zorro. So first appearance, um, it's going to be low print, I'm pretty sure. Um, and there's, a, I think there's a retro cover that's even more limited. If you see it, probably pick it up. It might heat up. Maybe. Um from Antarctic Press, we have another book called Cat Shit. <laughs> yes, that's right, Cat Shit. Kobasi Motofumi is a renowned war manga artist. Um, he takes a lot of detail in his work. Um, he is returning to the printed page, but at full comic size for the first time ever. So, I like this book. Um, I could see it getting hot. Cat shit. Ask your stores, guys. You have a couple days. You have a week. Or look around for it. <laughs> say, say, hey, guys, do you have any cat shit? <laughs> uh, and also from uh, Ann Architect, Exciting Comics number four. This is the variant cover. It says, who or what is the new Black Terror? The Crimson Scorpion returns as the professor. Uh, has some new powers. Uh, but a new evil is born in the wreckage left behind. There's a lot of stuff going in here. Uh, also, some more um, blackjacks from Bradley Golden, friend of the channel, great guy. Um, I'm hearing a lot about these books, so I would check it out. Also, Planet Comics number one. Oh, that is Jungle Comics number one. Sorry, bad cover. But Planet Comics number one... Uh, is the 80th anniversary um, of the book and it's coming back. I think Exchange Collectibles is also going to have a variant for that. Keep your eyes out. Make sure to turn that notification bell on in the ch channel. But also check your phone settings. I'm starting to figure out that's why a lot of people aren't getting notified. Got to make sure you have YouTube to allow um, notifications on your phone. So check your phone settings. I think that's the secret everyone's been having problems with. Also, P 
punch nine, punch line number 11, it says the bad shepherds, so it might be a new appearance. What else do we have? Okay. F from Dark Horse, we have Frankenstein Undone number one. This is the Mike Mignola cover. Uh, a new Frankenstein book kind of thrown into the world of Hellboy. So I would check it out. Um, Mike could get hot. From IDW, we have Usagi Ojimbo Color Classics number one. The series collects the original early issues of the Long Running series, now in full color. Every issue will also feature new behind the scene material and art. Okay? There's a lot of fans out there for that book. Also, just throwing out there, also from IDW, is Star Wars Adventures. It's a funny cover. Uh, the spotlight falls on Supreme Leader Kylo Ren and his unstoppable First Order army. Kind of like a little origins. And. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number 102. Now, it says in the previews, unusual new minute, mutants. So there's going to be new characters introduced. So check that out. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles have been hot lately. We also have from Image, Ice Cream Man number 17, homage cover. This is kind of a just calling out a homage to Action Comics number one could be hot um all the action com i've looked it up all action comics homages no matter what comic they're on they always command more than what they're worth so you know 20 bucks is a normal price for anything with the homage in time from image as well we have redneck number 25 who is Demas, the first vampire? It's going to be a first appearance in here in Redneck, Donny Cates, guys. I would probably pick it up. We also have from Scout Comics a new book called White Ash. Uh, let's see. Something about an ancient evil that's returned to their town. You might want to look into it. Pretty reasonable low print. Also, I think this cover is going to be hot. Stabity Bunny cover B, homage cover, Spider Man, guys. Um, it's pretty dope. If I see it, I'm buying it. I don't think my store has it, though. But that cover is going to be hot. It's easy for me to say that. Tart number one, new book. This book is showing a little bit of heat as well. There's a couple different covers for it. Um, I would definitely look into this book. I mean, there's a lot of books I'm telling you guys about. And you can pick which ones you like. And please, comment which ones you like. Uh, but, you know, from homage cover to key factor, this is it. This is the video you should watch. Okay, from Source Point Press, we have Apocalypse Girl number one. Now, this was in the Exchange uh, Collectibles video earlier. They have exclusive rights to this cover. This is the original cover. They have it over there, Virgin, without the words on it, and uh, it's limited to 50. So if it isn't already sold out, I would suggest following the link at the end of this video over to that video or going to Exchange Collectibles in the link below. Um, you can use my 10% off code. There's a lot of different books coming out on the 29th that Exchange Collectibles has exclusive covers too. This one is dope, I'm picking it up. Let's see, also a book called Paradox. It's just a one shot. How do you save re reality from yourself? Um, Paradox was a sleeper hit when it first released independently. So I would suggest maybe picking it up there. <clears throat> this is how it's working nowadays. A lot of books were produced independently, like by the writer. They never got picked up. Now they're picked up. And I think it's in hopes that they're going to be pulled for movie deals or TV deals. And we're seeing a lot more of that. Check out this book. From Valiant Comics, another book that Exchange Collectibles has. Now, they don't have this cover. Exchange Collectibles has an exclusive. But I'm calling out this number one cover. 
Um, this is the pre-order bundle. If you can get it on the pre-order, that's the cover it comes with. Kind of hard to find. If you see it in your store, I'd pick it up. It's pretty dope compared to the others. Okay. From Vault Comics, we have Maul. Number five, the conspiracy is revealed. The murderers are known. So we're going to find out some stuff in that book. Okay, moving into DC. <clears throat> we have Action Comics 1019. This is the variant cover. I just pointed it out because one of the biggest battles in, in Superman history tears through Metropolis as the supervillain team-up of Lex Luthor, Legion of Doom, and Leviathan come to change Superman's city forever. The problem here is that Clark can't reveal his identity. There's going to be a lot of books, or Superman revealed his identity, uh, a bunch of different books where everyone's coming because now they know who he is, they know who he loves, they know everything about him, and they're going to attack that. So keep a lookout for that. Also, Detective Comics Annual Number 3, this is going to be the memorial to Alfred for his death. What else do I got for you sickos? Justice League number 39. Scott Snyder saying goodbye. This is his last story. They're going to move on to the new writer after this. Terrifics number 24. Who are the mysterious angels? That could be a key first appearance. Okay. Okay. Now, moving on to Marvel. Avengers number 30, guys. This is one of the variant covers, I think. Who is the shocking new wielder of the star brand? We look at the last one, number 29. At the very end, it shows a woman that's pregnant. That's all that you really know. I don't know who that is. Um, so we're going to find out, I believe, in this issue who it is. The new star brand key. And there's a new look, She-Hulk and Blade. So something's happening there. And it says, as, have you, as you've never seen them before. So that's a good book. has multiple keys. Another new book, Avengers of the Wastelands, number one. A new story from the world of Old Man Logan. Now, there's going to be a new team appearance in here, as well as some other stuff. I would say pick it up. Captain America 18. The new Scourge vs. Everybody and a heart-stopping climax that you'll never forget. Now, I know that Captain America 19 will have a key in there. Um, if you want, check out my video that I'll attach as well as the Exchange Collectibles showing all possible keys like this for the month of February. Like everything for Marvel and DC. You, you'll see more about Captain America in there. Uh, I'm just going to say it real fast. Uh, Captain Marvel The End. That's going to be number one, Death of Captain Marvel. I don't know if it's any key. Conan the Barbarian, number 12. I like this cover. This is the final chapter. Okay, and this is purely cover by Deadpool the End. Um, of course, Death of Deadpool, and the cover's dope. And Doctor Strange the End, same thing. Doctor Strange number two. Oh, wait. Well, just in case, Doctor Strange number two, enter the record of reality, possible key. Um, and then we have, this is a pure cover buy, okay? Fallen Angels number six. This is the 40th anniversary variant cover. It's sick. Okay. This is another cover by Hawkeye, Free Fall number two. This is the HOTS cover. Um, it implica It says that who's the Ronin? You're going to try to find out more stuff about Ronin. I don't think where they released that key yet, but the cover itself for Kyle Hotz is dope. I want to call out this book. I love. I really like this cover. Uh, this is the variant Del Mundo Immortal Hulk number thirty cover. There, I think there's like a new Hulk in town or a reemergence of an old character. Um, I would keep your eyes out there, guys, for Mortal Hulk number 30 and 31. Um, something could very well happen. And that cover's sick right there. That's a variant. Another big book, probably super low print. Try to get it, guys. Miles Morales, Spider-Man, second printing. 
Now we know that the first appearance of his sister was in that book. This is the second print, uh, second print showing that cover, that part on the cover. Um, it's probably going to be way lower print than Miles Morales, the normal print, and it's key. Ravencroft number one. Uh, it's going to be interesting. I'm calling out this Ryan Brown variant cover though because it's dope, and Ryan Brown is dope, and that's all I have to say about that. Maybe check out Spider-Verse number four, just throwing it out there. Next up, Star Wars number two. This is a pure cover buy again for me. Uh, it's the Ben Oliver variant. Dude, that is so sick, dude. Like, it's just so clean, dude. Ben Oliver, Perel, stuff like that. They do something with their art that just makes it so realistic. Another cover buy for me would be Terra number two. It's the Inyuk Lee cover. Classic Hulk and Thor. Thor number two. I would pick up every book in this new run. It's very interesting. Um, the Black Winter and the Devourer King. There should be some keys in there. I do know that we're going to be seeing Vader Ray Bill very soon, either at the end of number two or definitely in number three. And another big book I'm pretty excited about getting is Weapon Plus. I don't know if I put both covers in here, but they're both good. First appearance of Manslaughter. Um, and, it, you know, it's like the whole Weapon X program. This is Weapon Plus World War IV. And that cover's sick. And it's a first appearance, I believe. Got to pick it up. And lastly, well, there's the second cover, the variant. Okay. Lastly, I have in here, just as a cover buy, pretty much, X-Force number six, the 40th anniversary variant cover. I just, something about it I like. And usually when I like stuff, other people like stuff. Whether this channel manipulates what sells or not, I'm not trying to do that. I'm just pointing out the keys that I believe are keys and the covers that are hot. It usually turns out that most of these covers heat up. Um, but as you can tell, it's sick. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please check out these videos next. They're important. There'll be exchange collectibles video. There's a bunch of stuff. And all throughout the week, we're going to have exchange collectibles. And then below it will be the speculation show video where I break down all of February comics, all of them from Marvel and DC that have a true key factor. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like, and I'll talk to you later. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you want to use any of these coupon codes, go ahead. It's all there for you to use and abuse. Please check out this sick video next. And again, please hit that like button, throw a comment down, and please subscribe. Love you guys. Stay sick. See you later.